Hi class, welcome back for math today. Let's go ahead and get started with some subitizing. All right, go ahead and remember to put those numbers up on your fingers that you see and we'll shout it out together when we all have it. How many? Two, one, two, very good. How many do you see? Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Very, very good. How many do you see? I see nine again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three groups of three. How many do you see? Three. One, two, three. Excellent. All right, last one. How many do you see? Five. Your hand should look like Miss Husings. One, two, three, four, five. Five. Very, very good. All right, let's go ahead and get started with our writing. I would love to see not only your numbers zero to 10, but 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, all the way up to 20 because we are growing with our number writing and I would love to see that from you today. So send me a picture of your writing or make sure you write it down at home. If you need help writing the numbers, remember our ping pong song will tell you which way to draw the numbers and you can sing along there on our YouTube playlist. All right, today we have number recognition. Let's go ahead and get started. Starting with this number, go six. Four, three, zero, two, one, ten, nine, five, seven, eighteen. What was that one? Eighteen. Good. Thirteen. Thirteen. Sixteen. Eight. 20. Very, very good. Let's do some shapes. I'm only going to do a couple today. When I point at it, I want you to yell it out loud and proud. What is this one? Square. What is this one? Diamond. What is this one? Rectangle. You guys are going so quick. I think we can do them all. What is this one? Circle. What is this one? Hexagon. Remember, it has six sides. Six text. Hexagon. Good. How about this one? Oval and triangle. Good. Let's move to the 3D shapes or solid shapes. What is this one? Pyramid. This one? Prism. This one? Sphere. This one? Cone. This one? What was it? Cylinder. This one? Cube. Good job, class. All right. This Practice question today says solve. That means find the answer. Let's read the number sentence together first. Ready, go. 13 plus three. So do we have 13 fingers? No. So can we do this problem on our fingers and add like that? No. So we have to count on. We have to say, okay, we're gonna say the number 13. We're gonna say the big number first and then count on by putting up how many fingers? Three, we're gonna start with 13 and add three extra fingers. So we're gonna, Miss Husing will model it. So I'm gonna say 13, and then I'm gonna start putting up three fingers. 13, 14, 15, 16. Why did I put up three fingers? Because we were adding Three, I started and I said 13, that's the first number. And then I added one, two, three. So I said 13, what comes next? 14, 15, 16. So what is the answer? 13 plus three? 16, very, very good, good class. Today we are going to do a quick review. We are going to do kind of the same thing as yesterday where we went step up, up, up counting from 10 to 11 to 12 to 13 to 14, all the way to 20.
but today we're gonna practice going down and fill in the missing numbers. Going down by one. So we're gonna count and read and fill in the missing numbers, okay? So I need you to yell it out with me, the numbers that are here and the numbers that we need to fill in, okay? Here we go. What is this first number? 13, remember we are counting down. 14, this is 14, excuse misusing, this is 14, 13, 12, 11, what comes underneath 11? 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 comes right before 11. Very, very good. Let's go ahead and do this one. 15, 14, 13, very good. You might have heard Miss Houston counting down, just like I do in class sometimes. That is decreasing by one every time. We're subtracting one every time. 14 minus one is 13. 13 minus one is 12. 12 minus one is 11. 11 minus one is 10. What would be the next number? 10 minus one is nine, if we kept going down by one. Very good, so we're on the middle one now. We're at 15. 14, 13, 12, 11, very good. After 11, what comes one more down? 13, 12, 11, 10 again. Very, very good class. And if we kept going, what would be next? Nine, eight, seven, very good. Let's start down on the bottom one, last one. I would like you to write down in your notebook, get a pencil, get a paper if you need to, pause the video. Write these numbers, write 13, and then write 12 next to it, and then I want you to fill in those blanks next to it and go down by one every time. 13, 12, fill it in, pause the video. I will show you the answers in just a minute. All right, welcome back. You should have these numbers on your paper. 13, 12, 11, then 10, then nine, because we're subtracting one or decreasing by one every time. Very good class. Once you are finished, I would love for you to do some work on the computer. If you're tired of being on the computer for learning, you can go ahead and practice your number writing in your journal, do a worksheet if you have it, write some number bonds, draw some, um, some number sentences that you can solve um, or work with your manipulatives, okay? I will see you later for another lesson.